Hello friends, welcome to automation community. Today in this video, we are going to discuss an interesting example in which we will use timers like TP and TR. We will also use normally open contacts as well as normally closed contacts. With that, we will also use memory bits. So, Let's look at the example first. Batch mixing. The mixer runs for 10 seconds, then a valve opens for 5 seconds, allowing ingredients to float in. After the valve closes, the mixer once again runs for another 15 seconds. So firstly, the mixer will be on for 10 seconds and when I turn on the start button the valve will open after 10 seconds and the valve will be on for 5 seconds and when I turn on the start button memory bit will start after 15 seconds and that memory bit will be on for 15 seconds allowing mixer to be on for another 15 seconds so let's move to eco structure machine expert where we will draw a ladder diagram for this example of batch mixing i will open eco structure machine expert basic i will keep read protection as inactive and write protection as inactive and then click on apply then i will go to configuration tab here i can select a logic controller i will be using tm221 c24r i will click on it and drag it to here do you want to replace you may lose some features and associated configurations i will click on yes so the logic controller i am using has 14 digital inputs 10 relay outputs Two analog inputs, one serial line port, and 100 to 240 volt AC power supply controller with removable terminal blocks. Then I can also go to serial line where I can select protocol as TMH2GDP. And then I will click on apply. Then I will go to programming tab. So here I will be drawing ladder diagram for batch mixing. I can also click on this option to set a full screen mode. I will click on it and then I can also zoom into it by clicking on the plus button here. I can also zoom out by clicking on the minus button here. So firstly I will insert one normally open contact. I will assign address to this contact as I 0.0. .0. I will also add symbol to it as start button. Yes. And then I will insert a coil here. Then I will assign address to this coil as Q 0.0. I will also add symbol to it as mixer. So the mixer runs for 10 seconds. So we will use a timer that is TP and we will set the preset value as 10 seconds. I will insert a functional block timer here. I will change the type to TP time base as 1 second and preset value as 10 and then click on apply. So when I turn on start button mixer will be on for 10 seconds. 
Then, a valve opens for 5 seconds, allowing ingredients to flow in. So, the valve will get on after 10 seconds and it will be on for 5 seconds. So, we will use T on as well as TP. So, T on will delay for 10 seconds and TP will make the valve open for 5 seconds. So, I will add a new rung here. I will insert one normally open contact. I will assign address to it as I 0, 0.0 same as start button and then I will insert a coil here and then I will assign address to the coil as Q 0.1 I will also add symbol to it as val So, the valve should be on after 10 seconds. So, I will insert a functional block timer here. It should be T on. I will change time base to 1 second and preset value as 10. And then click on apply. So the valve will be open after 10 seconds. So in these 10 seconds mixer will be on and the valve should be on for 5 seconds. So I will insert one more functional block timer here and the type of the timer I'm using will be TP. I will change time base to 1 second and preset value as 5. So, when I turn on start button, mixer will be on for 10 seconds and valve will be on after 10 seconds and for 5 seconds. So, after 5 seconds, in those 5 seconds, valve was on. So, after valve is off, the mixer should start again and it will be on for 15 seconds. So what we will do is we will use a memory bit here. So I will insert one more coil here. I will assign address to it as M0. I will click on this option and then draw a line like this. So the memory should be on after mixer is on and then off and then valve is on and then off. So it should be on after 15 seconds. 10 seconds for mixer, 5 seconds for valve and after that memory bit should be on. So, I will insert one more functional block timer here for memory bit and that to T on. I will change time base to 1 second and preset value as 15. So, after mixer and valve memory bit will set to true and what happens is when memory bit will set to true the mixer so we will use that memory bit to, uh, to turn on the mixer for another 15 seconds so here in the rung 0 I will insert normally open contact here and then I will connect it like this. Then I will assign address to this contact as M0. So after 15 seconds, after mixer is on, then off, 
and valve is on for 5 seconds and then off, then also memory bit will be on after 15 seconds. So, after 15 seconds, mixer will be on, but it should be on for 15 seconds. So, I will insert one more functional block timer here. The type of the timer should be TP. I will change time base to 1 second and preset value as 50 and then apply. So, when start button is turned on, mixer will be on for 10 seconds. And also, when mixer is on, the valve will be off. And after 10 seconds, that is when mixer is off. Then what happens is, valve will be on for 5 seconds. And also, in the beginning, when I turn on start button, it will delay for 15 seconds to get memory bit on. So, in these 15 minutes, for the time, memory bit is delayed to be true. In that time, mixer and valve was on. Mixer was on for 10 seconds, valve was on after 10 seconds and for 5 seconds and after that, memory bit gets true. And when memory bit gets true, the current will flow through it and mixer will be on and that too will be for 15 seconds. So, I will exit full screen mode. I will compile the program. Then, I will go to commissioning and launch simulator. And then I will start controller. To do so, click OK. Then I will go to programming and launch, sorry, set full screen mode. So, when I turn on start button, that is I 0.0, .0 mixer will be on for 10 seconds. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And after that, valve will be on for 5 seconds. 3, 4, 5. And then memory bit will be true. And when memory bit will be true, the motor, sorry, the mixer will be on for 15 seconds. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and then gets turned off. It was all about this batch mixing. Thank you for watching.